Equation say that the battery, the battery of 40 volts and internal resistance 10 ohms is connected to a resistor of 70 ohms. Draw a diagram of the circuit and calculate the terminal PD. Now the terminal PD is the uh, volt or potential difference that um, is recorded outside the battery. Let me just uh, put it that way. That is the PD across the terminals. That is, uh, you, know, you know how we, we, we want to call it EMF. EMF, that's the, um, the potential difference that we have inside the battery or the chemical cell. And now, when we talk about the PD, terminal PD is the one that is going across the circuit. Now, by the time we finish the drawing of this circuit, you will really understand what I'm trying to say here. So let's look at the say that they say draw the circuit diagram. Now let's look at the circuit drive so that we will be able to understand what we really mean by that. Now we have a, a the diagram is something that looks like this. Can leave it like this, and then ah, this is what it looks like. So this is the now the the P, the terminal P D is this one across the uh, terminals, the potential different across the terminals. That's the terminals, and this other one. Is the one uh, the volt here is the one inside the cell. So the question said that we should calculate the um, the terminal PD. To calculate this terminal PD, we know that um, the EMF, the total energy um, potential difference now we have, or the EMF is what the EMF we have is the volt, the one that we have here, the terminal PD plus the internal which is this other one small one and to get this internal one we are already given the um we have the resistance there we have the resistance internal resistor we can say that v is equal to the e is also equal to v plus um i and then r now you notice know, in this um Circuit, the current remain the same. Why the resistance is different? The, the, the resistance we have different resistance. The one internal and external. So we can also say it's like this. Now we also know that to get the current, to find the current, according to Ohm's law, we say that is that is proportional to. Uh, um, both is that proportional to um, current, so which means volts, and then to get current now we we'll have equal to V over R, so that is how we get the current. Now we can use this one since we know that V over current will give us, um, so, so, sorry, please, um, V over. The system will give us current, so we can also substitute, we can also add it there. Then we will have something that will look like this V over R times small r, all in brackets. So in this case, what we have here again will be plus V R over small r over um, big r equal to the EMF. Now, since we have V here and V there, we can choose to put the PV outside the bracket. We have 1 plus um, R over what? 
big R. So that's what we have. So based on that now, which is equal to also the EMF. We can now use this. We can now use it to um, find our what um, the potential difference, the terminal potential difference. So now let's see how we can apply this our formula we have here. No, 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 this that side. No, 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 not of band. Okay. Um, now we have our EMF. The total EMF we have there is 40. And then our votes, we don't know. That is the potential difference. The terminal potential difference, we don't know it. Then we put a bracket, so 1. Plus our internal resistance, which is 40. Is that 40? Okay, 10. That's 10. And the terminal resistance, we say is what? 70 all in brackets so the next thing we're going to do here is um we can cancel out we we'll have 40 equal to v bracket one plus i think this one can go we can cancel it out if we cancel it out we have a um 0 0.143 0 0.143 approximately so the next thing we are going to do is to sum up if we add up this we will have a 40 is equal to this plus that we still leave it in brackets we have 1.143 so v multiply um, 1.143 in order to open the bracket so we have 1.143 V equal to 40. Equal to 40. So now V will then be equal to 40 over 1.143. That will give us um 34.99 volts. Or can say approximately. Or we can say is what well, 35 votes. Thank you so much for being part of it. And then, oh, if you like this, you can also subscribe and leave your comments in the comment section. Thank you so much.